A volcanic eruption in Bali has spewed plumes of smoke and ash, grounding flights and straining thousands of tourists. The top of Mount Agung's crater, which is about 45 miles from Bali's tourist hub in Kuta, fired smoke and ash 6,500 feet into the sky on Thursday evening on the Indonesia Resort Island. A spokesman for the airport said that the island's main International Gateway said around 280 flights have been canceled, which affected more than 15,700 passengers. Two small airports in eastern Java also had to close. It is risky for planes to fly during volcanic activity as the ash they emit can be sucked into their engines, causing them to fail. It also makes runways slippy. The main airport reopened about 2.30 p.m. Friday local time, nearly five hours ahead of schedule. In November, the volcano Agung erupted stranding thousands of travelers and sent tens of thousands of residents fleeing to evacuation centers. The volcano has continued erupting sporadically. The Volcano Observatory notice for aviation issued a orange level warning and officials predicted the ash cloud will move west and southwest of the island, adding that there may be an in increase and earthquake tremors. Now, Indonesia is along the so-called ring of fire in the Pacific Ocean and is home to around 130 volcanoes. Agung's last major eruption was in 1963, which killed around 1,600 people. What do you think? What is causing all of these different volcanoes all across the world to erupt? Leave your comments below this video. Thanks for watching. <laughs>